sun is shining and Chris is reading leaflets. We need to book our bread the day before Ooh. in that place. You better go and book it then. Come on then. Hey? What, in the little hexagon hut? Yeah. Or over there? Oh, right. No, in the little hexagon hut. Book your what, bread. over there? Yes, Reserve Votre Pan. Book your bread. Oh. Thing. This, is, this is beer. and this is Jeremy Clarkson's beer. Yeah. Obviously, it's good to have a bit of culture <laughs> in the Champagne region. <laughs> champagne and diddly squat beer. No diddly squats. What you got for dinner? <laughs> Sorry, Steve. What are you cooking? <laughs> um, what? Take three. Yeah. Yes. Well, actually. Um, on the Tapanaki grill, which is free because we pay for the electricity, the very French repas or meal this evening is Old El Paso Pachita, which uh, with smoky barbecue, and uh, I'm going to do the tortillas on okay. here as well. Chin chin, fonte, everyone. Peter Bear, what do you think of the whole scenario? Hmm? Is that good? Is it good? No. No. Very handy little windy bag that I've just used to pop over to use the facilities. <laughs> We're going in with number one. Number one, the fruit selection 50% Pinot Noir, 50% okay. Chardonnay. Cool. Very pleasant. Very nice. Very, Very nice one, unassuming. One. This could go horribly wrong. This is Chardonnay. I have a bit of a history with Chardonnay, but we'll see. What a fantastic vocabulary you have for <laughs> wine tasting. Actually, I find that tartar. The there is a little bit. Fruit. Yeah, same. A bit more sour. Nice. <laughs> Can't get a bite out now. Oh, Why, what's happened? We're blocked in by the bikers. Oh. Future bears. They'd be staying here for the day. <laughs> and it is 100% Chardonnay, as proven by a small bit of video as my wife had one sip, and then ran off and had an altercation <laughs> with a bunch of bikers over there who... Didn't class yet. It's okay. Blocked. Blocked his ear. Who blocked him? Well, I to uh, told him, didn't I? Uh, in no uncertain God, terms. And yeah, they still part there. <laughs> So uncertain terms in English. <laughs> that smells like something you used to have when I was a child. Oh, what? Not a child. <laughs> <laughs> My children's champers. <laughs> this is a lot drier. So it's a bit tart <clears throat> on the tongue. It's still nice though. It's not tart, is it? It's a little bit. What do you think of that one? Sweet. Too sweet. That will be because it's 8% and mean. some Mounier grape in there for the red. It's a different grape. <laughs> I'm sticking with number one, thank Which you. Which is your favourite number one? Yeah, see, number I liked one. number one. See, I'm one, still number one. That was the first one I had. I still. Mm -hmm. It's alright for you, we've just got to have champagne. We take the bottle of Blanc de Noir. Hmm. With Blanc de Noir means that you have just the grape variety of black grape, so you have the Pinot Noir and the Meunier in the region. This one is 80% of Pinot Noir and 20 of Meunier. We have citrus of black fruit like cassis, also a good mineralty and a good roundness. And this bottle is a brut, so you have a low dosage of sugar. You have 6 grams in the liters and uh, we smell in house.
It's an extra brut with a Pinot Noir coat. Yeah. Noir. Great. Okay. Think? I think yeah. Excellent. So per yes, the instruction of having... Brute. Oh, okay, so it's the what they do here. Extra brute is what they do. Oh, okay. So, it's very dry. More, more importantly, Tyrrell's crisps. Mm. You can always make a caviar... No, he's having a second one. He hasn't pulled a face. What do you reckon? This is just it's shippings, shippings with little balls in it. <laughs> I'm not a fan of a it's ball like in my mouth. <laughs> Especially a fishy one. <laughs> Definitely not a fishy one. Look, he's talking about So, what do we think of it? Lovely well. It's very nice. Nice on the palate. <clears throat> Very good value for money. <laughs> Very good value for money. Yes. This is number one. You don't like you like number one from the other place. About you the same price as this. I liked it from the last one. That last one was the best one we've had. Sure. This one, this one, the one we just went yes. to was nice. Yeah. Yeah, which is yeah. twice the price as well. Exactly. Well, yeah, yeah but you get it was very nice. Yeah. You do get what you pay for. You yes. Have two of these for one of them. Mm. Yes. So what do you want to do? I think you can smell the nuttiness in it. Oh, yeah. yeah. And that's, that's because How nuts in there, Chris? No nuts. No, it's right in the middle of your tongue. It's definitely a nutty. In the middle? Middle of your tongue. I'm yeah, bloody middle. I can't balance the wine. How do you put it in the middle of your tongue? At the back in the middle of your tongue, it's definitely a nut. Want to know what everything's happening? And everyone else finishing up their champagne in our final champagne of the day. This one <laughs> in Abergen. We have gone for the brute, seventy percent Chardonnay grape, twenty percent Noir grape. <laughs> Ten percent Merlot. Yeah. Lovely glasses, and what look, what's good? The stem is a little bit like a thermometer. Huh? It's got a nice head on it. <laughs> and it's very it. okay. minerally, I think, and it's a nice, lovely. Want of a better word. <clears throat> Is, am I right in saying you don't taste like gooseberries or different fruits in there? Is well, it's a weaker, t apparently, champagne. Now, I may be wrong, but the actual ta the taste, raw taste, which is why Cremont is more flavourful, is more to do with the light taste that goes in with the bubbles. <laughs> uh, I don't know how to describe champagne, do you? Right. I, I think it's all about oh. the dryness. It is a bit lively, isn't it? Oh, lively. That's the That's a bit lively, word. Chris. It is a bit lively. <laughs> Everyone's waiting in expectation. Oh, this just keeps making me regurgitate fish guts. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> Taste of sweets. There's the sweets. No, I'm not getting that. Oh, you need bloody nuts with the sweets. Now. Uh, a bit horrible. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get any. 
the eggy, the egg one. <laughs> the egg caribou is in there. Okay. Cheers. It won't be the last one. No, it'll be the last, we're the last Here. one tasting it. Cheers. Oh, hang on, let me go back. Cheers. So, a slight addendum to the uh, trip from the final thing, but we've come back to where the bicycles are. And they're still here. And there was once again another debate. And we purchased those. And Chris has got a new bike bag, a sac de velo, and we got some more champagne. And Keisha actually has got a special champagne water bucket. Have a drink! Yay! There we yeah. go. Token drink, well done. So is Mont Blanc behind that tower? This way, it's behind me. Oh, behind you. Right at the top. The top is the icy bit. Is Bit of yeah, we are, we are. And, also... <laughs> and, <laughs> and 